Great Mayor Mike Duggan is planning to challenge the 2020 census results. He says he has proof the city was undercounted by thousands of people. Fox News' Robin Murdoch is live with me. Good morning, Amy and Jay. Mayor Mike Duggan, he's pretty fired up about this situation concerning the latest census numbers that he says are wrong. And he says they aren't off by just a couple of hundred. He believes that they could be off by tens of thousands of dollars, and that could cost the city a lot in federal money that they could certainly use. Now, a team of researchers out of the University of Michigan, as well as Wayne State, they were brought in and they were the ones who discovered that Detroit's results were not properly counted and that it could affect federal funding for certain programs. Now, according to these researchers, the 2020 census po possibly undercounted Detroit by some 31,000. That is how big the gap is from the previous year's population count. Now, one of the biggest discrepancies they saw is that the vacancy rate in some of the city's most stable communities, the latest census numbers showed anywhere between 10 to 17 percent vacancies, while the mayor's team of researchers, they found less than 10% in the very same neighborhoods. Here's more with Mayor Mike Duggan. All we want as Detroiters is to be counted. They had one job and they missed by a huge number. Now, the mayor tells us he does plan to challenge the latest census results. He will bring his concerns to the Commerce Department. And if that doesn't work, we could possibly see a lawsuit in federal court. We'll, of course, keep you posted on what happens with this. We are live in Detroit this morning. Robin Murdoch, Fox 2 News.